My name is Vash the Stampede! Ladies and gentlemen, forgive the lack of warning, but I'm afraid it's time for my daily massacre. And if you don't believe I'm the real thing, take a long look at me and start freaking out. Observe my red coat, my lovely blonde locks. And if you're still having doubts, check out my 100% accurate gunmanship. The Vash? You mean to say he's the Vash, the stampede? Huh? Can this man really be him? He's absolutely nothing at all like I envisioned. How is that possible? Yeah, I know. I have trouble believing it, too. You mean... Oh, hey, gee, sorry about that. Do you have any idea what you're getting yourself into, mister? This gentleman here is the one and only infamous humanoid typhoon. He's bashed a stampede. Now that's funny. Pardon me. But I was under the impression that he was a lot more handsome. Is he there? Is that him? Yeah! Oh, mercy, mercy, mercy! Ah! What do you mean? You're telling me now I can't come in? Who do you think you are, you needle noggin' idiot? Oh, hey, Doc. <laughs> Is that your great legend? Is that fool him, huh? <laughs> the man who will slaughter the innocent does the most evil of evil deeds with a price of 60 billion double dollars on his head? Yes, I am that man! What a nice, dependable yeah. guy, and oh. modest as well. <laughs> Isn't it wonderful? Hey, oh. With Vash around, the people of the mansion will be safe. <gasps> I am known as Valentinez Alcalinella Zihak Shushira Boheretz. Gumbi Gobella, <laughs> Blue Stradivari, Talentrent <sighs> Pierre, Andre Tartenhemos. If our Vinci Baldos George Deutzel hmm. Kaiser the Third, don't hesitate to call. Hello. Hello. <gasps> oh. Hello. Hello. Oh. Well, hello. Hello. You never know when Vash the Stampede is going to show up and then kaboom. Oh wow! Hmm? Huh? Well, hey there! Whose idea was it to use the grenade? He can't be identified for the reward if he's a pile of pulp, you die! <laughs> 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 for all your help. He might not have made it otherwise. Think nothing of it. If you need anything else, all you have to do is ask. You know you're wrong. That's just beautiful. Now to catch some more Z's. Whoa, man! I'm really, really sorry! Are you okay, mister? The deadly dodgeball head! A simple technique to hold the ball in place with intense suction! Try this at home! Thoughts of home, whether good or bad, are positive indicators of a journey of the heart. Uh, <laughs> so, anyway, what would you say to having lunch with me? Not a chance. <clears throat> I lost my room, so can I share yours? But you have a bed right out there. <laughs> <laughs> That's so cold. From the moment I saw her, from the look in her eyes, Miss Marianne has a beautiful heart. You're the easily deceived type who cries himself to sleep every night, aren't you? <sighs> Thanks a lot, Dream Wrecker. Where can I find the man in charge? I need to speak to him. And just who are you people? Let me <sighs> see the man in charge! Did you say bodyguards? Exactly. If you two were here to protect us, we'd feel a whole lot safer. I'm sorry. Thanks anyway, but company regulations strictly forbid us from taking any part-time jobs.
That's two bacon lettuce dogs, two cartons of milk... Wait a minute. Four bags of pretzels, and one pack of raisins. I must say, I am very curious as to why you insurance girls are here doing this work. Care to let me in on it? Well, we didn't have enough money for a ticket, so we got a part-time job here. Altogether, that comes to twelve double dollars and seventy-five sea cents. It's actually a miracle that I got away with it this time. I found him! <gasps> Over there! <laughs> Perfect shot! Warning! Your ID has not been registered. Therefore, you may not enter this area. Huh? You will now be removed by force. Where are you going? To the party, sir. He did save our lives. Pretty pathetic hero, if you ask me. Who are you supposed to be? Are you suicidal? Or too stupid to know better? Huh? Huh? That guy's just an idiot. Takes more than just an idiot to be screaming that way. Well, I guess we got five hostages now. Oh boy, I'm dead. Nobody's dumb enough to buy such a lame story. It's the worst one I've ever come up with. It's all right. I understand. It must have been so hard. Don't worry, I'll protect you. Darnation! First the war dries up, then that dang criminal, the humanoid typhoon, shows up. This town ain't fit to live in no more. Yeah, bash the stampede. The new hired gun at Saints Oh, shut up. This town is finished. Bad times are here. La 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 She really needs dancing lessons. You don't like pain, do you? I'm used to it. Well, I feel sorry for your wife and kids. You'll make them cry. Ain't got no kids, and most women find me pretty offensive, so I'm single! Sounds like a pretty lonely life. Tell me, how does it feel to kill unarmed innocent people like that? And I have a question for you. Do you feel anything when you burn your garbage? Nifty answer. Sorry I asked. I've always had my suspicions that you were no mere mortal, but I never imagined you were actually a cat. Wait! What the hell am I saying? Where is that idiot?! I suspected he might try this, so when I brought him breakfast earlier this morning, I slipped one of these into the food on his plate. Oh my gosh, that's a transmitting device. I'm amazed the company let you have something like that. <laughs> Since I'm always messing up, the chief gave it to me as a going away present. He says it'll keep anyone from outwitting me. <sighs> Millie, I hate to tell you, but that's nothing to brag about. Look, look, he's really close by. We're catching up already. Yeah! Warmer! 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 Meow. Oh my god! He changed into a cat this time! Millie! Any other siblings? No, but there's oh. ten brothers and sisters! Uh-huh. You're the youngest, aren't you? Yeah! Well, how did you know that? We're going in. Right. Who's drinking? I am! Oh, yeah! Uh, 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 hey, don't let her have too much, all hey, right? Hey, lighten up. Yeah. Oh, I feel so hot. Wow. Hey, don't do that here. You go, go, big girl. Get your clothes back on right now. Stop Whoa. that. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, please fill her up, miss, if you wouldn't mind. That's better. Give, give, me, give me back my gun, Grandma. Uh, uh, huh? What happened, brother? I don't know. My head just started to hurt. Uh, Thank <laughs> heaven you asked. It's a long story, although it's kind of a short one. This ain't got nothing to do with you. Uh, huh? Oh. What's the matter with you? That happened to be my can of pudding. And you wasted oh. it. You should never get between people and their pudding. But you are the one who dropped them, you know. All right, all right, all right. Whoever did it, come out with your hands up right now! 
kids back. Why are you pointing that thing at me? Well, it was you, wasn't it? As long as we're clever about this and treat them with courtesy and respect, we have nothing to fear. <laughs> You've got a lot of nerve coming back uh, here. Please accept this token of goodwill. Nebraska family, what are you doing here? Both of you are supposed to be serving a jail term of 700 years. Shut your stinking trap! We released ourselves yesterday at our own discretion! That... that is called a jailbreak! <laughs> what? You haven't done anything, so don't hug the limelight! Oh, Mom, you're funny! Don't be such a stick in the mud! I don't have it, Dad. What in the hell is someone like me supposed to do for a living where I can help people? Huh? What are you getting all sentimental on me for, you little squirt? Feeling better now? Mm -hmm. he, he's here. Total slaughter, total slaughter, I won't leave a single man alive. la di da di da genocide, la di da di da an ocean of blood. Let's begin the killing time. He's... Singing? God, what horrible lyrics. How dare you? You have a lot of nerve, you impudent scoundrel. We're not dumb enough to be scared by you and your rotten friends. Oh, yes, it's become clear to me now. There's a lot of meaning behind those words, friends. So stand up with your heads held high and say what you want to say. We won't give up our land no matter what you do to us. Yeah, we're not going to take this anymore, and you can go back and tell that to Morgan. Did you hear what I said, you old geezers? Hmm? Oh, hello. Sorry, I didn't see you there. He'll be all right now, I assure you. I know that, no problem. I just stopped by to see if I could help out. <sighs> you just gonna sleep? Snap oh, out of it! What the hell are you doing to him? He needed it! Doctor, look at that! Oh my gosh! Hey! Pretty tough to kill when you're shooting with rubber bullets. <laughs> what are you doing? Don't ask ridiculous questions. I'm gonna save the child! With your bare hands? <gasps> oh, shit! Huh? Uh, hey, I don't want you killing anyone, all right? Why don't you just ask me not to breathe? Thou shalt not kill, remember? What kind of church man are you, anyway? Hmm? You can definitely count on me, Mr. Cliff. Ugh. I don't let anyone in my sights get away, and I'm known for my bullets never missing their mark. Especially if it's the heart of a beautiful lady. Bang! Ah! Meryl, you okay? Vash, are you all right? Have you finished writing the papers yet? No, but I'll keep at it. Millie? Millie, where are you? I'm out here. Good morning, Meryl. Ugh. What have you gotten yourself into now? Well, I'm being punished for coming in late for work 20 times in a row. Oh, it's a warehouse. Huh? What's this? Looks like trunks. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Countermeasure number one. Take the place of a hostage. Won't work. Number two, then. Send everybody into a mad panic by shouting, Earthquake! Even worse. Well, then, what do you suggest? That's enough! Stop that! This instant, you blithering coward! That advance payment I made you wasn't cheap, and I expect results! So get your act together right now! Do you understand me? <laughs> Come 
coming through. Excuse me, lady. Sorry about that. Ooh, this is bad. Looks like a raid. <laughs> hey, look! Something's coming this way! Look. Shut up! I told you to stay still! All right. Let's stop this now. Come on! Hey, wait a minute, Meryl! Come back! Meryl! I guess I'm just lucky that these girls aren't too swift, if you know what I'm saying. <laughs> Phenomena. Is this some sort of twisted Christian science? Oh man, why can't I just get a break? Death and poverty like me so much, they brought friends. Hell, little lady, he's the humanoid typhoon. Now. <clears throat> What's with the hand next to my knife, buddy? Sorry about that. Hey, are God's little creatures wonderful and so darn smart? <laughs> oh my, I'm about to go down in flames. Don't worry, I can handle it. I am unique and eat anything I want to. I have a separate stomach just for cake and ice cream. Isn't this the most beautiful day you've ever seen, Meryl? Yes, it's beautiful. It's the kind of day that just makes you want to sit here and forget all about your problems. Don't you agree? Yes, definitely. In fact, it makes you want to completely forget about work and take the day off. Not a chance, but nice try. Shucks. Reality check, Meryl. The attitude of yours gets all the oddball jobs, working with dangerous slime. It's great that you're so competent and willing, but if you keep risking your life out there, I'm afraid there's no way you'll ever achieve womanly happiness. Excuse me, is this social time, ladies and gentlemen? <laughs> I meditate diligently every morning. The subjects are life and love. I quit after three seconds. Oh, this is a great day! Hey, I'm injured, remember? <sighs> that makes us even now for your help on the sand steamer. Huh? Hey, is that all the time I get? 